with so many different Jeeps and so many variations on a theme. So that's one of the big traffic differences for this year that we haven't instituted in the past is the roundabout traffic. Okay. I mean, I find that hard to believe. on Fall Colors Tour 2010, oh, okay. this okay. is, well, you know, that's probably the first actual trail I did was this trail right here. This first time I've been on this one. Nope. Yep. How are we running, Ernie? Good. Yeah, All good. Take a picture of you tree huggers. Yeah, we got us some tree huggers. Oh, we, come on, get on in there. I'll, I'll hold that man's hand. I, I don't care where he's been. <laughs> I'll risk it. What do you got? You All right. Oh, we only oh. four this time. I'm taping. Yeah, four. You guys must have lost some weight then, huh? Well, we had Joe. <laughs> 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 Andy and Joe made it. There we go. So, we got it. I didn't photograph. I didn't treat. Yep. All right, four guys. That's oh, how big the tree is. I got gotcha. you. Hurry up, Pokey. I've already taken it. Oh. Come on, we'll check you for tips. <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah, hear me. I heard you the whole time. Yeah, so hopefully we got that figured out. Hopefully, that's why. Well, we, had, we had just started up this road when I heard you say that we're going to turn right on the Grand Canyon. <laughs> So, all right, let's get them loaded up. We're good. Going now, right? I got her out. Right. Got your in gear, baby. Yet again.
Okay, he started. Natural habitat. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't I get a hard time for not posting the news at the driver's meeting yesterday? So I remember right, so I'm on it. I used to have really long hair back in college. Oh, yeah. Metal guy. Yeah. And so. So anyway, I guess I can pull this back. All right. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Fall Color Tour 2021. Woo! Sure. 
find the perpetrator and reward them appropriately. <laughs> so,
Hello. Oh, you're all right. I'm I know your dad, he's not tall. Was your mom tall? Yeah. You know, my mom wasn't tall. Yeah. Well, you got a tall milk. Right? Yeah, tall milk. <laughs> <laughs> so this is all four mile, but you're going left on 309 and four mile right on 309? Is that? Yeah. Yeah. But this is the way you go on four I mile. I missed a turn back there, just not very far out of the parking lot. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. So we made a little. So we made an out. We went around the outside. We made a little extra loop. I yeah. hope you do have some angles so we can get out of here. I do. There's enough turns. I got a picture of Wally going through that water. Yeah, he and he just totally—it it almost looks like a wave. It just—it's he just curling hard. around like that. <laughs> well, I, I hit it a little bit hard. I almost killed it. I hit it yeah, downhill. I, I had it to I hit it yeah. downhill. Whoop you do. And my brace was still wet, and I almost ran. No, we just <laughs> I hit that well, downhill do whoopty, and I smashed my brakes, and I just get right on going. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. That's really going for it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I scooped up some water in the fan blade. Yeah. These brakes don't kill the water. crap anyway. But mm -hmm. Oh, I don't. Yeah, so just the Colorado control. In order to get on that. Hey, how's it going? Hey. Checking on your stuff. There's some uh, trail mix there in the back, Mike, if you want something to snack on. Hey. So how's it going so far? It's great. No problem. Fantastic. You see me almost killed in the water over there? No. Oh, yeah, I did, actually. Yeah. <laughs> it was deeper than I thought it was. Yeah. Well, I've hit that harder before in the two way, and I've got a picture of Wally where that's just curling around like a <laughs> surfer wave, but.
Tell me when. You got four more feet to have when. Prospect holes. Uh, it's a prospect that came and he dug for a while. And if they found something, they keep on digging and it'd become a mine. And, and uh, they dug a hole and find anything, they move on and leave the hole behind. So, that, that looks to me like maybe they were finding something they kept on digging. Wouldn't be a, uh, it wasn't a tunnel type mine, you Just know. Just an open pit. I think you know the the ground is not So, uh, I'm kind of doing what I should have been doing when I was 20. <laughs> You're catching up for all of Exactly. Yeah. I tell you, that's good stuff. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Yeah, I'm not quite so cold this morning. Alright, we've got uh, two rides going out, and uh, but before I get talking about the ride, I've got a request uh, for everybody. I know a lot of photographs have been taken. Time the two-way page has ever had a thread with over 100,000 views. <laughs> right now, we are at 123,000 views. So we're getting a very large following for this year's thread, and uh, and a lot of those folks would like to see some photos. So we would appreciate it if you could if you could post even just one or two, just to let them <coughs> see what you have seen uh, while you're out here. That would be great. Um, you know, I'm getting emails. Literally from around the world, people are interested in what we are doing this week. 
It's got a nice boulder rock feel, um, shelf, shelf road, mine, beautiful scenery. It's, it's, a, it's an up and back trail. Um, I guess you call it more of a rock crawling trail. Um, Grizzly Lake is got a beautiful lake at the very top. The thing about Grizzly Lake, there's this one major obstacle, which they call the gatekeeper, which is a big rock, um, big rock ledge that you have to get over to get up into it. The rest of the trail is not too bad. There is a shelf, a, a, a rocky shelf road that will take you up to the, to the lake for a little ways. But um, so for people who want to do that one, some people want to do Iron Chest, and you can make your decision once they get to the, uh, the back end of St. Elmo. So if you've got any questions, um, I will say this. Both uh, trails, you don't need lockers, but it's highly encouraged. Um, we've got some stock jeeps through there. It's just a little bouncy. Take a good line. So we've got uh, Ron rolling out on channel five, uh, going that way. And we've got <coughs> JPET on channel three, going that way. It out there's the rock directly behind, behind it. Yeah. So, you can't see so perspective is difficult. This is a better But you can see the Say something. Third gear hill. Third gear Third hill. hill. Twelve years later. <laughs> <laughs> though you know materials are just getting ridiculous well they did a rerun of the white top for the fives and stuff oh did they and yeah a couple years ago but they didn't do the tiger top can you still get them or not uh, i don't think so yeah it was uh it was probably been five years now too and everyone's got the food out of their mouth and we'll uh This is Jay Pet Action Reporter for the CJ2A page.com. We are here on the fabulous four mile. Yeah, 23, 24 Jeeps out here today. So, stand by for news, okay? So, hey, this is, I'm DJ. This is Samantha. It's my mom, Lou Ann. Oh. And uh, we're from Texas. Nice. And uh, Jeep doesn't have a name yet. Okay, well, we'll work so on anyone, that. If anyone has an idea, let me know. We'll, we'll look into that. Hello, JPEG. How's it going? Pretty good. How are you doing? 
Alive and kicking. What's your name? Yeah. Mike Rice. Mike Rice. Jeep got a name? The Jeep's name is Joey. And where are you from? Originally, we did not name him, but I'm really? show you why we named that. It's okay. Like, All right. from Montrose. Nice. Just about three miles away. Nice. Or three hours away. That's the reason. Hi, Jeff. Hello. How's it going? <clears throat> Johnny Jeep. Yeah, sure are. Yeah. Dusty. Yeah. He's home. She's sick. Oh. Back at Mike's. So I'm doing a ride along today with Alan. And you're from Missouri. Wentzville. Wentzville. We're going on a Missouri boat ride. Yeah. And your Jeep? That's Jeff's. Jeff's. Jeff oh, where's yours? Over here. I just told you, Dusty Six. Oh, okay. That's right. Sorry. Yeah. All right. Hello, Jeff. Hey. I'm Bruce Walker. I live in uh, northeastern Colorado. And uh, this is my Jeep. Call it Uncle Lehman. Yep. It belonged to my great uncle when I was a little boy. Yep. And you're Bruce W. on social media. W. Who we got here? Oh, you bad. Hi. Got a 48 CJ2A. They got a name? Matilda. Ma Waltzing Matilda. Matilda. And your name's Kate. My name's Kate. And your name is? Giselle. Giselle. Yep. Nice. Jerry Walker, I'm driving the uh, Bulldog. The Bulldog. Nice. That's Bruce's, yeah. Hey, who are we? Who are we? Darren Lina Bensinger. Hey, has your Jeep got a name? Alonzi. Yes. Alonzi. And you're from P Pennsylvania. Which, as you know in French is Let's Go, which is what Eisenhower said when he decided to go to Normandy. Nice. It's raining on the 5th. We're going to go on the 6th. He said, Let's go. You're from Pennsylvania, is yeah. Nav uh, Ron or what's it called? DNL Bensinger. Norman, PA, yep. DNL no, Bensinger, Norman, Pennsylvania. Norman, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Right. And, uh, yep, this is a Jeep we made and took to D Day for the 75th anniversary. Very nice. Very this nice. Special four inch longer Jeep so you can Oh, yeah. Steering wheel, although I didn't need Sure I is. When I went over there. Who are we? Walter and Sandra Schroth. Yep. We're from Indiana, Pennsylvania. Hometown of the late great actor Jimmy Stewart. Right. This Jeep is known as D Day. D Day. It is a cousin to the one in front of us. Right. It also went to the 75th anniversary um, in 2019. Nice. Brian Collins, Tamaro, Illinois. Yep. Jeep don't have a name. Okay, we'll work <laughs> on that. <laughs> Uh, I'm Chris from Santa Ana, California, and my dog, Ricky Bobby. Yep. It's his Jeep. Ricky Bobby's Jeep. It pretty nice. much is Ricky Bobby's Jeep. Okay. Yep. We're the No Name Brothers. The No Name yep. Brothers. Russ and Gary. Yep. Well, Colorado well, Springs and Denver, and this is maybe the 10th out of 14 of these I've been on. Yep. What's the Jeep's name? No Name. And still No Name. No Name Jeep. I had to drive about an hour and a half to Hi. Hi. I'm John, otherwise known as Jolly Roger, and my Jeep is Nelly Bell with my friend, pay attention, with my friend, Joan. Very good. And I haven't killed him yet. And and, and you're from Missouri, too, on a Missouri boat ride. Yep. <laughs> Hello there, JF. I'm from Missouri, and no, I'm not from Missouri. You're from all over the place, I'm but from currently. I'm formerly Ohio, now yep. from Oregon. Yep. I'm here having a great time. Yep, good. Your Jeep got a name? Yeah. Lieutenant Bob. Somebody Lieutenant Bob. Lieutenant Bob. It should be Lieutenant Diane, shouldn't it? No. Yeah, my dad's name was Bob. Hello there. Hi. Uh, Rod, Susan, and Abigail Kamlenik from the Harrisburg, Pennsylvania area. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. And it's our first trip here and having a wonderful time. Nice. And we refer, we refer to this one as the Little Jeep. <laughs> okay. Very good. Very good. Hey, who are we? Hey, I'm Tom from Ohio. Tom from Ohio. Your Jeep got a name? Itchy. What? Itchy? Itchy? It was an itch I had to scratch. Nice. This is X98 from New York. We're going to interview him in a second. And this is Keith's Jeep from Ohio. We put it back on eBay and sold it. And uh, signed the title and sent it for the guy. And the guy never came out the Jeep. It's been like 
that's got to be 10 years now. No kidding. Oh, now he doesn't have the title. Well, yeah. Go get another one. yeah, so it was uh, New York. Who are we? Woohoo! Bill Davis. Bill Davis from Vermont. Vermont. Ernie Pineda, Corona, California. Hey. Dick France, Montrose, Colorado. Cleo, California. <laughs> Marky Music, Montrose, Colorado. What's the Jeep's name? Slumdog. Slumdog. <laughs> Your Jeep have a name? No, sir. Just uh, the Blue Willies. That's okay. <laughs> we're, we're working on that then. <laughs> Who we got? This is Lumpy with uh, Bradley. I'm Eric. Both Rico, the city metro area. Rico's your name on the social media. Pages. Yep. Chris from Colorado Springs. This is my 3B silver bullet. Silver bullet. All right. We'll get these guys right quick, and then we'll leave a. Oh, we got some more over here. Sorry about that. Okay. What's the Jeep's name? This is Maggie. This is a 42 GPW done up in Airborne Brit. Nice. Sweet. So that has a few of the British modifications on there. We're yep. from Missouri. I'm Jeff Brundle. That's my wife, Mary Ann and Drew. We got a lot of Missourians. Yes, we so. do. It's a good place to go jeeping. Very good. Well, since these guys are busy, I'll just introduce them. I was always going to rely on my buddy down in Arizona that can still get it done. Yeah. You, know, you guys want to say hi right quick to your fans? Oh, hi, fans. Hello, fans. Who are we? Uh, Finn from Norwood, Colorado. Uh, Keith Buckley, better known as Joe, Joe Friday from Stowe, Ohio. Bob Westerman from uh, New York State. Hey, his Jeep is X98 over there. I'm Dale Campbell from uh, Arizona. And what's this Jeep's name? This is Gonzo. Gonzo. Gonzo's a CJV35. Look at that. All right. Sounds like I got everyone. So... We're going to move on for the cj2apage.com. This is JPET reporting.